Hello everyone folks and welcome on back to Creepy Catacombs. I think that yeah, the third to last level in the game. And there's a bunch of ghosts, and this area is crucial too, I think. Because the key to rescue Miss Pac-Man is behind the gate over there somewhere. In ghost. There's a bell in yeah, there it is. Let's kill one of these annoying things. I don't know what they're called, I don't remember what they're called. Okay, we want to go down here first, I think. Hopefully. Just like with the uh, underwater maze from down the tubes, take the first path available, I think is what we want to do here. So let's go down here first. And, uh, avoid these squ squashers again. This one you'll be more careful with, though, because there's no room to, to stand on the side, so you have to activate it from the uh, edge of it and jump, and jump back. To the platform that you were already on. Now some more pet dots you can collect on these dangerous platforms. I'm gonna do that, of course. Maybe. Oh no, it's not. I didn't get all the pet dots like this throughout the entire game because sometimes I've died from the ghosts or something, and they just some of them disappear, especially the power of the pellets. But we got the bell now, which is a very crucial good thing because now we can size wait for the torch skeleton to stop blowing fire at us. And these will open these areas up. There's other stuff over here too, like the power pellet. We want to quickly take the ghost out and God knows where the rest of them are. Right? There's, there's four of them too, all four of them. Okay, we got them all. Beautiful. And we got all our health back. That was excellent. One of the best runs or moments yet in this LP, at least by playing. Nothing over here, is there? Nope. You can just run across these, actually. Okay, now we just kill him and get the key at the same time. How nice. Bananas are from the maze, so I don't have to worry about them. I already went down there. Another torch skeleton. Another checkpoint. And C uh, is uh, something we had to get with a special ability, of course, which we don't have the ability to get there. Yeah, which is a chrome ball. We need cherries to get into the room with the chrome ball. I better get these just in case they disappear. I'll be that sure. So let's get these pack dots first. Actually, the cherry might be over here. Yeah, so we had two regardless. I don't know. Oh, that's good. That I forgot about. Nothing over else over here? Nope. Now we can go back and get the chrome ball so we can protect ourselves from this fire, especially the one guarding the sea. Man, oh, I missed a pet dot right there. Thank God it didn't fall. I know I possibly could have still got it without the chrome ball, hopefully. What the hell is that rumbling about? There's a peach we need as well, which is the M's located, which we've already got half the letters, so that pretty much signifies we're halfway through the level. More down here though. A useless piece of health and we'll go ahead and get it since we hopefully we'll have to come back down there. Except for maybe something evolving actually. Shit almost fell and died. That's not a good thing at all. That's how you get those two without falling. Now we got the uh, peach, so let's go back, of course. Why the hell wouldn't we? Now we need coming back, unfortunately. All the skeletons in the game, from the pirate levels and the mansion levels, will come back once you leave a certain distance from them, and they're back too, of course. There's the M. Get out of my way, please. T.S. It doesn't sound really good. I said it anyway. Alrighty then. Wait for this stupid shit. Come on. Oh god, I'm glad I waited. I was gonna get right into it. Okay, it's for you. I think the A is in there. And this is how you're gonna get the bell, I'm sure, is by... Hmm, I'm surprised it didn't hit me. Climbing these gargoyle, gargoyle heads and the bell should be on the end of them, yeah. Doing a pretty fine job, if I say so myself. 
But when it comes to the level itself, I don't think I've died once, but I can't remember, so don't quote me on that. That's almost not like the same stuff as blowing out. Something like, I don't know, blowing hot steam. I don't know, yeah. Except it doesn't have any sound effects. So it's not the game glitching, it's actually how it is. At least as far as I know. Probably make, probably have no sound on the, playing it on my PS2 either, but I can't remember on my PS1. I haven't had it in so long. Don't worry about the cherry door, it's over here. That's where the last letter is as well, so yeah, I'm gonna conclude this over now. And this, in my opinion, may, I think is the easiest possibly of the mansion levels. That's all the letters, so congratulations. Level complete. Hopefully, you've made it this far with me as well, or will make it this far with me as well. Bonus level time. Let's see if I can finally beat this damn thing. I never have before. And I hope I can, you know. I'm sure you'd agree with me on that. You know. You do a good job, come on. Well, I got those done. There's four switches you have to hit. Damn, that's scary shit right there. Oh my god. Wow, that, the platforming on those coffins is very sensitive. I barely held back a tiny bit. Trying not to uh, fuck up my jump or something, and I died. I fell and didn't grab a hold of the side of the coffin. See how hard that is? Oh boy. It's the only one I have yet, yet to accomplish. Luckily, beating them is not part of 100%. Then again, it'd be kind of fun if it was, but whatever. Yeah, we don't, I mean, let's get that. Over 40,000 points, and uh, save the game. And there's the little effect that you get at the end of this level with it raining. The next level is going to rain, so it probably has something to do with it. A sign of things to come, probably. 79%, so almost 80. By the way, I don't think by the end of the game you will be seeing a 100% clear screen because the only way you can see it is if you beat the Marathon of Mazes first, then beat Talkman and Talkman's Lair, the final level. Then it'll say 100% complete with a portrait of Pac-Man and his family. But, but uh, the way I'm going to do it, I'm going to beat Talkman first, then the Mazes. But it still will be 100% though. Don't worry about it. Oh, come on! Die already. This level is grave danger, by the way. I didn't have time to mention if I was in the middle of talking about something. Another bat to kill. Oh shit! <laughs> Did you see that? I fell all the way down there without having to take it. I didn't mean to, though, of course. God damn it. I'm supposed to take the elevator down. I thought this is where the pee was gonna be. What the hell is it? It is here, okay. Luckily, I can get back down there, right? Anything else over here? No. So you had to go all the way to the left first to get the first letter. Uh, the key, of course, for Miss Pac-Man, the final person to rescue. Yeah, this is the second to last level in the game, the last platforming aspect level. Come on. Level 20 of 21 total. And the third of the mansion levels. Come on. This level actually might take a little while. Plus, when I had to cut early in on in it. Early enough, whatever. Depends on how far I get in it. It also has more of a kind of dangerous uh, item and platform element in this. Oh shit, better use this thing, man. God, I got the chrome ball right now. I'm gonna make good use of it. Alright, I've got the cherries now for the door we, we need to go back to. Whatever's behind it, it looks like it's kind of maze. Yeah, I'm right. Yeah, we're down to less than a minute already. So as we continue from the last level, of course, it makes perfect sense why. Don't it. Okay, we only got one power pellet. Let's make good use of it. Got you. He's been conquered. All of his friend. I think that's it over here, right? Yes. That's affirmative. Uh, we can head forward, but the item I'm talking about, which is difficult to deal with sometimes, is thunder clouds. Thunder and lightning. Oh, sorry about that. Thunder and lightning clouds. 
these things. I don't have to be careful on these two because sometimes there'll be items on these things. Oh shit. Oh man, I need dumbass. Oh, I went barely over time, but it's okay. See how fast time went? Well, I'll see you next time where we continue on through grave danger and no telling how far we get in this one. This one's a little bit longer, so yeah. Take care.